guys and welcome to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to make a super cute donut squishy. Before we get started, if you're new to my channel, then hi, I'm Alina. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on any new videos and be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. Without further ado, let's get started. So to start off, you're gonna need some memory foam. I got this out of a memory foam pillow I found at Walmart. Now I'm gonna take a pencil and trace a circle. Then when you're done, you can go ahead and cut it out. So after cutting, this is the shape I have. Now I'm gonna go back over with my scissors and fix all of the rough edges. Be sure you're cutting small snips. The smaller snips you cut, the better shape it will be. So after a lot of cutting, this is the shape I got, and be sure to take your time on this, it does take a while. So now we're gonna cut the hole. So now I'm gonna press my finger in the middle of the squishy so it's nice and tight. Now I'm gonna take my scissors and carefully cut a hole through the center. As soon as you make it all the way through, then just go ahead and keep cutting. Now I'm gonna draw a circle with my scissors so I know how big the hole is going to be. And this is what it should look like, and now I'm gonna take my scissors and finish cutting out the insides. I found this very time consuming, so don't worry if it takes you a while. So after a lot of cutting, this is the shape I have. So now we're gonna go ahead and paint the squishy. It's best to use puffy paint, but I couldn't find brown puffy paint in the store, so I'm just gonna use regular acrylic. So for the frosting, I'm gonna be using white, but you can use any color you want. The brown paint ended up being darker than I thought, so I went ahead and added a layer of white over the top to fix it. So this is what it should look like so far. After the frosting is dry, you can go ahead and add another coat. So for the sprinkles, we're going to be using some rainbow colored paint. I'm going to use toothpicks to put them on. Now just wait for it to dry overnight and you're done. Alright guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. I post new videos every Wednesday, so be sure to hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on any new videos. And I do have an Instagram, so if you guys would like to check that out, it's alinkaloo.crafts. Bye, see you guys next week.